magic tricks. So bubbles and balloon animals. In most Chinese pediatric hospitals, crowds and endless crying are the major sights and sounds. But the Shanghai Children's Hospital was filled with laughter today. In the lobby, outpatient departments and wards. The Israeli consulate here have invited Mir Raz and Sarhan Mohammed to Shanghai to promote what's called clown therapy. It is aimed at reducing the fear and anxiety created when kids see doctors. I thought they were a little bit scary at first, but now I, I don't. They're really funny. I would love to see them every day. The medical clowns don't just work with kids, they also visit parents and medical workers. If we succeed to make the parent happy, it will bring happiness to his child. And if the staff is happy, they will give it to the children. So it's a, it's a circle. It's a circle of happiness. All medical clowns have a BA, some of them in drama, in theater, in arts. And after the BA, they train for a year and a half of an intensive course uh, with medical staff, with professional medical clowns, learning and sharing from their experiences. So this is something very serious, and medical clowns take their jobs very seriously. The medical clowns were also big hits at two other pediatric hospitals in Shanghai, Fudan University Children's Hospital and Shanghai Children's Medical Center. One official says he'd like to have Chinese clown doctors in his hospital, but there are some problems to overcome. Considering the crowds, I don't think it's realistic to have clown doctors in outpatient departments. But we can start with having them in wards, and the limited medical resources pose a challenge for doctors and nurses to pay enough attention to the psychological aspects. That's something we have to work on harder. In the United States, professional clown doctors first began working in New York hospitals in 1986. There are clown doctor programs throughout Australia, New Zealand, Canada, and all over Europe. And most of the clowns are full-time hospital employees. Xin Jing, ICS for CCTV, Shanghai.